Hi, my name is Sin Ing. I wrote the song A Plan in response to the movie Parasite by Bong Joon-ho. Briefly share how you got to know about the Small Projects Initiative and why you decided to join it. So I've worked on a few uh, TRC productions previously. I was really craving a creative outlet or an arts related project to work on since Compared to 2019 when I was working on productions one after another, in 2020 when COVID came and the sort ended, I felt like my life took a 180 degree change. I started a corporate desk job and a few months later I felt like I was gradually getting further away from the arts. So when I saw the call for sign-ups, I thought why not? Share what inspired you to create your piece. I think that COVID really highlighted the income disparity in Singapore. Initiatives like the Where's Mutual Aid, just coming up to facilitate community efforts so that we can all work together to help each other tag through this. I guess at that period, there was a lot of frustrations towards the inadequacy of support systems or like government support. Uh, people are starting to feel burnt out trying to help others in need and just seeing the bleak numbers in the news every day hearing about the situation in the migrant workers dormitories and at that time i was also struggling to find a job and i was quite frustrated at the lack of government support in the arts i guess i just had a lot of pent-up frustration at the capitalistic system that we're in and that was also the time where I watched Parasite for the first time. My problem was to reimagine uh, an existing narrative as a musical and write a song from it. I felt that the way Parasite was written had a very clear narrative arc with a lot of exciting moments and I just thought that a lot of these moments could translate into nice musical numbers. What I did was I spent a lot of time dissecting uh, the movie and the hope that they the family refuses to let go of, uh, the tenacity to keep finding ways to make ends meet, and the hope that life will get better. So in that scene when ki leaves for his job interview, he really believed that this job will change their lives for the better. In that scene, his expression and the way he said it just made me feel really uncomfortable. Just how much hope he had put on this job I thought that maybe it's this hopefulness that's the parasite, the refusal to let go of this hope, even after the movie ends. So if you listen to the ending credits, uh, it was also him just trying to find ways, like, okay, I'm not going to spoil it for you, but yeah, uh, it brings out a lot of his hope. So I decided to base this song, uh, base the song on this moment. What are some fun facts about your piece that the audience may not know. So if you've watched Parasite, uh, parts of the dream that uh, Kiwu sings about in the song actually shows up in the movie also. So I took a lot of inspiration from the different scenes in the movie. Uh, and the bridge leading up, up to the chorus, the it's also inspired from the end credit song I was talking about earlier. So it's actually the same tune, just in a different rhythm. And I hope that I didn't infringe any copyright. It's just a parody. So I just thought that it would be nice to have the dad sing a similar tune, and then the son sings it again in the credit song in completely different situations with different emotional baggage to it. Uh, what are some challenges you face creating the piece? I guess the biggest challenge would be the lack of time. I know I keep complaining to my friends about it. Uh, I really underestimated how busy my day job would be and uh, having to work on this song, this small project on the side is quite taxing. Lah. So also, I guess having to work on this myself because uh, it's the first song that I've written so I was feeling very lost uh, and like had like imposter syndrome. At one point I was just thinking, what made me believe that I could like that I had the ability to do this for myself. But I had a lot of support from the people around me and from TRC. Like uh, Sophie would keep checking in and was always very encouraging. Uh, I met Cheyenne and Wei Ting to 
work on the arrangement together. Like they were so magical. Like I got a lot of help from them. Joel, Shamin, and Jia Cheng also. Uh, during our recording sessions, we had a lot of fun and they were very encouraging. And when everything came together, it was actually so much better than I thought. And I'm just very thankful for the team for that. But if I had more time, there are definitely a lot of things that I want to change about the song. But I'm just very grateful that we were able to produce like this decent first draft of it. So I hope that you like it.